Hey there guys, so tonight I thought I'd review a SWAT Cats the, Ra the Radical Squadron. Now as most of us probably know, SWAT Cats was a, a show created by a Canadian animation team known as uh, the Tremblay Brothers back in uh, 1993. And uh, the show followed the uh, T-Bone and Razor basically pretending their fellow feline American citizens, I suppose, of uh, Cat Catropolis or whatever the town was called. I forget the present moment, but <laughs> um, and basically T-Bone and Razor are basically the, these uh, me mechanics that got kicked out of the Air Force for being too uh, too aggressively, or got kicked out of the town's uh, fighting squad for being too reckless. And they basically spend the entire series sort of being the uh, sort of Batman-esque protectors of their city, even though the, o the only one that knows uh, the Swan Cat's true identity is... Um, the mayor's most personal assistant. Kind of like how I guess again, um, Commissioner Gordon was with Batman. And um, now, some of the SWAT guys' most, uh, n noble villains were, of course, uh, uh, the Time, the Time Wizard, the Time Cat, whatever his name was, of course, uh, uh, the robot cat, and of course, um, the commissioner himself for sort of being the anti-hero. Um, now, of course, unfortunately, the show was taken off the air be before it had a chance to conclude. But the Tremblay brothers have been attempting to um, revive the show in the form of SWAT Cat Revolution, which is still supposedly... Hoping to get production ready to go by the end of this year. But overall, Swan Cat, um, the Radical Squadron is a pretty good show. Definitely worth checking out. And I hope you guys enjoyed. See ya.